Shouts out to Dope Dealers. Are you with me? Pour the whip it. Crack cooking 101. Have y'all, if, if you've ever heard that song before, it didn't know who put that out on the streets. It was one of the hottest songs uh, a couple summers ago on 104. It was crazy. The brother that brought it to you is my man L.I. Give it up for my man L.I. He's so goddamn cool. He didn't clap. He didn't even clap. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck do you think he is? <laughs> Tough niggas do this. Tough niggas do that. <laughs> That's all me, baby. <laughs> the people who haven't seen you in a while, uh, they thought that you had went away and got rich and forgot about Rochester or went to jail. It was two rumors out there. <laughs> Tell the people what you've been doing, man. Well, I've been working. You have to working, speak up, Pippin. I've been working, working, working hard. I've been in the studio hard by. I've been, I've been uh, just learning more about the business. You know what I'm saying? The success of that song taught me a lot uh, about, it taught me that I need to know a lot more. That's what I'm saying. Um, so, you know, it grew legs of its own and it started getting out there a lot more. There's a lot more things that I need to have prepared for, for you know, to be prepared for success, basically. So that's what I've been doing, preparing myself. Because we, we didn't miss you, man. I, I always tell people that you are hands down by far one of the most lyrical brothers that rap, period. You are my favorite local MC. Like people put a lot of names out there, I'd be like, what about L.I.? Like, man, fuck L.I. He ain't just saying that. Like, 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 you, like, because we, you know, we grew up together on, on, on Joseph Ave, you know what I'm saying? Joseph Ave represents, show him the iron, because they don't think you hood, man. <laughs> they think it's a facade. <laughs> they, they, you hood, man. You from yeah. Joseph Ave. Really, really from, from Joseph Ave. That's a L.I. You ain't going to be able to rob nobody. You know that tattoo. <laughs> Give me your money. L.I. <laughs> <laughs> L.I. Oh, man. Sure, sure. Um, where do you see yourself going in the next? Cause brother, I mean, none of us are spring chickens anymore. Where do you see your your, your career popping off? What do you think it's going to take for you to get national stardom? Cause you're a local celebrity, but what is it going to take to get national and worldwide notoriety? Um, take that right. Take take the right music. And take the right attitude. And take the right. Brands, uh, marketing and promoting the brand yourself. Like I now I move myself as a business. You know what I'm saying? LI is a business. You know what I'm saying? So as long as I put myself out there the right type of way, and you can have the hottest music in the world, but if you don't put it out there and market it in the right type of way, then you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's, it's like I always say, you can get famous a million different ways. I could I could pull my penis out right now. Everybody remember that. <laughs> is that how I want to be? Why you have to go that way? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Niggas would remember it. Yeah, that, I mean, you can't I, end that with had no to make it extreme. <laughs> had to make it extreme so you understand what I'm saying. Like, right. you know, at the end of the day, it's a million different ways for you to put yourself on the map. You just got to find that right way for you that, that fits you as an artist or as a business. You know what I'm saying? And put yourself out the right way with the right type of music at the right time. Time what, is a lot of time. What do you think about the state of music right now? Do you, do you see yourself as having your own lane? Definitely. Definitely. I, I mean, I, I say that because I, I talk about a lot of the same content that um, that other people have. You know, ain't nothing new under the sun at the end of the day. But I try to stay. I, sit, I stay true to myself. Can't nobody be like you. You know what I'm saying? I'm a hands on. So at the end of the day, it's like as long as I, as long as I stick to stick to me, stick to what my truth is, then that's what it's going to be. I'm going. It's no. It's it's never going to be off of it. That was beautifully said. Mm -hmm. That was beautifully said. Eli, what can they look forward to from you in 2010? What you got coming up? Oh, no. Oh, I'm coming for the summer. I'm coming for national summer. Not just local summer. I'm coming for the summer. I've been preparing myself. I've been preparing the good music you need to hear. I've been preparing everything. I'm coming for the summer. I'm going to make it hot. I'm going to turn it up about 100 degrees. Mm -hmm. I heard it here first. Panel, do y'all have any questions that y'all want to ask Eli? I love your songs, man. I love your music. I just can't let my kids be listening to it. <laughs> talk about some crazy shit. Well, no, that's, no, that's why we got to cook the whoop. You know, cook the whoop? Cook the whoop. <laughs> that's, 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 oh, that's the radio yeah, version? That's the radio version. Cook it's the like, whoop. You know, we're grown ups right here, so I can say cook, right. cook the crap. So what? But, you know, when, when, you know, when we're in the car with our kids and whatnot, that's why we have it. Cook the whoop. You know, so, what do you advise I, I tell my son when he be like, cook what? What is he talking about, daddy? 
The noodles? Cook the noodles. The Raymond noodles. I got a question for Li. Um, you know, I think that um, a lot of your local artists found it very difficult to get their records played on the radio. Um, I mean, obviously, I man, your record is in you know heavy rotation. It's been in rotation for a long time. Um, what advice would you give to kind of the local artists in terms that are you know looking to get their records uh, played on? Uh, on, uh, on Cause you got a new one on the radio. What's yeah. the name of the new song? Um, I'm the one. How, how, you, how you keep getting on the radio, man? Well, it's called Payola. No, I'm not. No, <laughs> For no, those that don't know what Payola is, yeah. Payola is no, when you talk. walk up in there in the radio station and you yeah. drop some cash on it, like, play this. Nah, nah, nah. That's Seriously. committing to Payola. <clears throat> Seriously, the way out of that, um, I mean, it, it was just a blessing, you know what I'm saying? Um, it, you, you know, you got you got to know the business. You got to know what the radio is looking for. You got to, how, how I always say, like, people ask me, how do you get your song played on the radio or how have you got your song played by DJs or whatnot? For one, you gotta kinda know their side of the business too. You gotta do your research. You know what I'm saying? You can't, this is like Mo. If Mo don't wanna say, you know, if you, you gotta know the venue. You know what I'm saying? You can't come here and say, yo, I wanna I wanna have a slam dance party here. This is not that kind of <laughs> You know what I'm saying? This is not that kind of place. I wanna have so a penis pulling up contest. <laughs> like Mo ain't going for it. Yeah. <laughs> So you know what I'm saying? You, you gotta do research, you know what other people want, and then know what you can deliver and how y'all can, you know, how y'all can uh, help each other. But I just, it was just a blessing. I kept going hard. I just put my, sending my music in to who I knew that, you know, the, the program director, that's who would get your song on there. I made, made relationships and whatnot, and kept sending my music and sent good quality music on top of that. You can't just make anything. Now I don't care if it's a good song. People don't know that you might have to, you know, that it need to be engineered or this, that, and the third. They might just not like the song, not nobody don't like it. You have to good, have good, you know, have good quality music. I got good quality stuff.